Good morning, a bit of a different one today. So, looks like you're coming with me for the day. I'm going to do a 350k today, and come home, have a sleep, and then do 250 tomorrow. No, so, 300. Oh, 300 tomorrow. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I'm doing 650k in total, but we'll see how it goes. Um, so yeah, you'll be uh, coming along with me and Poco today. So, yeah, strap in. See you soon. And that loud mouth you can hear in the background is Amy. She is out of the pit. Um, but we are actually doing the 200 kilometer event together tomorrow. But we are do no, let me get on to that. So we are making it a 300 bar talking there and back. So we're ECE in it. So yeah. ECE so what? the event, the 200. The Ordax. The Ordax event, yes. People won't do that, they can't mind me. Right, okay, I'm getting chatted at in the background because apparently people can't mind me, but I'm sure people know as well enough now to know that we do all axes, so. Anyway, see ya. <laughs> you idiot. Now about 50 miles in. What a lovely morning. Nice and cool, so I'm not getting too hot. Uh, just remembering to take my time. Quite easy to get carried away. Keep remembering to eat which is something I struggle with sometimes, as much as you lot probably don't realise, is it's hard to remember to eat when you're riding. So, what a gorgeous bike. Right, 40 miles in. Look at that view. I don't know if you can see that. I'm not quite as good as Amy at doing all this. But in the countryside now, uh, it was quite a busy road and stuff like that to get out to this point. But I wanted to try and keep the route as short as I could to do the distance. So yeah, got my music on, enjoying the views, the sun's coming out later. Still quite warm. Um, loving riding Poco, just rolling along with a big smile on my face. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try and crack out as many miles as I can without stopping towards Boston. Um, just so I've got an easy over at home. So there is a bit of a wind, so there might be a bit of a headwind on the way back, so if you get there, I've got a bit more time on the way back. Right, so I've stopped for a snack. It's warming up now. I've done around 80k of the 250k that I've got, to, uh, 350k I've got to do today. Um, so I do have about, I don't know, 270k to go. But it should be nice and easy now. The first, there's not much climbing in this um, today, but there's the, the, what climbing there is is at the start and a little bit at the end. Um, what well, majority of it at the start. So it has been a bit up and down, but easy stuff, not not super hilly. So yeah. Right, you. So about uh, 140k in now. I think I've only got. 40 or 50k to Boston. Well, Curtin in precise. There's a bit of a story behind why I'm going there. It's because I went to secondary school there for three years of secondary school. Uh, I lived on a council estate in Curtin. And uh, this will be the second time I've ridden back there. Um, and it always gives me a sense of feeling of pride when I go back knowing that's what I've come from and crazy how things change so yeah let's get there right I mean good get in I'm fear plugging a little bit because I've done 101 miles which is like 164 k in five hours 20 so yeah a bit tough going but let's get some tools so this is a really really weird throwback these lanes that I'm currently riding on is back in the day when I used to go out with my mates this is where we used to ride a lot on the BMX though one of my mates used to live not too far from here so yeah really weird riding here again <laughs> so you're probably wondering what the hell's going on well I'm having a bit of a lie down in the grass and the beautiful heat <sighs> <sighs> just enjoying myself. Well, I've not seen a shop for a while. I could do with refueling up with some um, snacks and some water. Um, 
left here. But I thought I'd have a little bit of a lie down, stretch myself out, enjoy a bit of the sun. I'm 210k in, maybe 220k. So I'm getting there slowly but surely. Well, I'm about to have a sit down. Oh, that headwind on the way back is absolutely brutal. It's killing me. It's just a shame Amy's not here to sit behind me. But, I've just got to keep going. I'm on the last set of hills now, which is like, with the headwind. They're not really like big hills, not compared to what I'll be doing tomorrow anyway. Um, and they're quite easy to do on a normal day. But with a lot of distance in your legs, with a headwind, it's some tough going. But, I'm not rushing, there's no point. I mean, it's a beautiful day. I'm going to be back home in plenty of time to have a decent sleep tonight which I'm more than happy about, so, yeah. Right, it's 10.23 in the PM, mm -hmm. he's back. He's 350k down. I'm sorry about the delay on the updates. I was there, uh, I was in the zone and it got pretty tough. Yeah. So, filming was lasting on me mind when I was going up loads of hills, so. You've done really well. No. 250k to do tomorrow, and then you're ding dang done. 600k mm -hmm. in the bag. Yeah. I'm not good on the camera because I'm in my PJs right now and I'm ready for bed. Mm -hmm. I'm not being in bed by now, but I waited up for you. Mm -hmm. I cooked you dinner. I felt good most of the day, though, to be fair, but. Yeah, really all the well. hills seem to be at the end. Tomorrow's a hilly day, though, isn't it? Move. Tomorrow's 200k and two th over 2,000 meters. I think we're a nice bath or something now. Mm. Just to relax the muscles. Yeah. But just what I need. And then you've got a 5 a.m. start tomorrow. Mm hmm. I'm doing 200k with you, I'll drive there, and then you can have a lift back with me. What I will say is, I'll be riding very slow tomorrow. Don't you worry, I'm ready for a slow ride. Mm. Right, ta-ta. Ta-ta. <laughs>